The Optical Reference Calibration Satellite, or ORCASAT for short, is a small satellite being developed by students and researchers at the University of Victoria as part of the Canadian CubeSat project. The Canadian CubeSat project is a Canadian Space Agency initiative which awarded grants of $200,000 to one university from every province and territory in Canada. ORCASAT is British Columbia satellite and is set to launch in 2021. While it might be small, measuring only 20 centimeters in height, ORCASAT packs a big punch and might help cosmologists learn more about one of the biggest unsolved mysteries in their field, dark energy. Dark energy is said to be responsible for the accelerating expansion rate of the universe, and the only way we can learn more about it is by getting more and better data. Professor Justin Albert, ORCASAT co-principal investigator and professor of physics and astronomy at the University of Victoria, claims that our measurements of the universal expansion rate are fundamentally limited by two sources of systematic uncertainties, that is, atmospheric and instrumental interference. Using a special type of star, known as a type 1a supernova, we can reduce these uncertainties up to a certain point, but a new method could prove to do it up to 10 times better. This is where ORCASAT comes in. Using an artificial star, ORCASAT will calibrate ground-based observatories from low Earth orbit. After being deployed from the International Space Station, ORCASAT will enter an orbit of roughly 400 kilometers. Once over an area of interest, ORCASAT will activate its artificial star and take a reading on board of how much light is actually being emitted. At the same time, an observatory on the ground will take its own measurement of how much light is being emitted. These two measurements will be different. The difference between the actual and perceived emission is due to interference. And once we know how much interference is present in our measurements, we can account for it at future measurements at that point in the night sky. This novel calibration method will be demonstrated on some of the world's leading observatories, including the Verici Rubin Telescope in Chile, which is equipped with the world's largest digital camera. The project has involved over 60 undergraduate students from the faculties of engineering, science, and social sciences. ORCASAT is more than just a satellite. It's an opportunity for students to blend in-class learning with real, hands-on experience in an applied research setting.